pick and Lee. I don't know how Hawthorne want that in particular matchup at this point. Sewell hurried kick down towards half forward. Enright goes back, coming through strongly. Bateman hand passes to Franklin. This could be the fairy tale start. Shields tries to get to Sewell. Varko's tackled good. Forward though by Savage. Oh, great mark. They're all getting involved, the big guys. Gee, right now the high ball in's worrying Geelong, isn't it? He's got it. They've got four, and they've come from their three big guys. And Geelong conceding 55 points a game coming in. Already 26 on the board for the Hawks. Just under 14 minutes to go to quarter time, but things may improve for the Cats. About 30 metres out, goal umpire does not move. And gee, they needed that one. Already an early goal from right in front. Which looks good. He's held the line. He's kicked two goals. Now it comes across to Podsy Adley. Awkward bounce for Ling. Slapped away down there by Hodge. He could have almost won a free kick. Savage feeds it back to Sewell. Confronted there by Chapman. Oh, yeah, two hand. of the toughest guys in the league. To get the margin back to just 12 points. Despite all the sizzle from Hawthorne. You've got to smell what the cats are cooking now. There's Lonigan coming away from half back to the wing. Podsy Adley stretches, marks it in the shadows. Back towards the corridor. Duncan lays it off. Kelly nicely done. Chapman a real influence now. Barco slips it over the top. Wing into a triangulation of fire. But he kicks a goal. Well, I think back to when Franklin came off the ground. I'm just wondering, he hasn't had a possession since. Stokes across towards Duncan. Duncan bounces off a teammate to Kelly. Kelly goes long down towards full forward, pushing the back. Podsy Adley. Here's Podsy Adley. How about this for a comeback by the Cats? They're rolling. They trail by a point now. Here we go. Now man up on Ruffy. Suckling, cruising past after the kickoff, gets it back, runs to half back. Mitchell gave him the hand pass. Missed by Mackey. This could go coast to coast. Roughhead's got it. Goes to Young. Goals Beckham, you betcha. Then he goes and kicks the goal. Rioli. He's running hard. Rioli, and that's a beautiful kick to the middle. And Lewis juggles the mark. Hawks up by four points. Chapman comes from behind to stand the mark. Lewis goes towards the pocket. The mark is taken by Roughhead. Starting the day, he had booted 18 goals in 10 games against the Cats. This one on its way. Looks pretty good. He's got his second. He's going to come right across the ground here to Menzel. Menzel hasn't taken long to be busy off that sub. And Menzel goes to the pocket. Selwood running hard, no one on him. Good looking kick. He's got it home, Selwood. Aguera. And Varco, and that one cut off as well. So Mitchell, Franklin, bringing handball on. Bateman's been quiet. Good looking kick. Going home. All the way. They work it around the outer side. Mitchell sends a long ball towards full forward. Lurking at the back was Lonigan. Bateman's got it now. Deep in the pocket, Bateman. Oh, that's two back to back. Johnson down towards full forward. Ponzi Adley surrounded. Chapman emerges with it. Couldn't get boot to ball. Hot one came out to Gillum. He's over the football. Just slaps it off the ground. It's good. Duncan got it. Gee, Stevie Johnson getting a lot of ball in this quarter. And that's a lovely kick back in. Corey. He could kick a goal here, Corey. <laughs> They're within a point. Their last goal from a very unlikely source. Joel Corey. Never more than two goals in a game as Bartell kicks it down towards the pocket, falls in front, dunk and a half chance. Ponzi Adley kept coming. Selwood's got it, puts it up for Ottens. He's in best position, he's got the mark. Ottens, 15 metres out. This to bring it back to less than a goal. He puts it through. Get the handball to Stokes, DeVarco, vintage Geelong. Oh, oh hits Ponzi Adley, lace out. Pods leans back. Goes to full forward, Menzel, not quite, Stevie J. Varco, there, Whoop. back in a big way. Bartell, deep into attack once more, missing the ball, Hodge, lurking at the back, Birchall, getting a hand in Varco, 
He was a bit unlucky there. It comes back to Bartell anyway. 25 metres out. This could bounce through. Was it touched? I don't think so. Taylor over early and Lonigan's filled the breach. A chance for the Hawks. They need a late one. Lewis measures it. Guerra can kick it. He does. <laughs> They're still in it. They kick two goals in the third quarter. He doesn't want to go for goal, but he got him. It's been a long time coming. It has. Good kick. <laughs> He's done it, buddy. He kicked through. Hawthorne within a point. Out of the middle, Chapman got it from Selwood. Kicks towards half forward. Chopped off by Bartell. Hand passes across to Menzel. That was brilliant. Menzel the Kelly goal. What a youngster. That's awful. Oh, yeah. That just kills you. And then Scarlett in short. Menzel, he's been called to go. That's a wonderful <laughs> kick. He's a footballer, Menzel. And Duncan finishes it off. An enthralling contest in perfect conditions. The Hawks with a slight lead at the main break till the Cats had a seven goal to four third term, eventually posing their fifth win of the season with a 19 point win. Fantastic victory, 17-15-100 and 17-15-8-98.